we saw a bird today. Yeah, it was so beautiful, and we've never ever seen one like it before. Even I've never seen one like it. We were hoping you'd know what species it is. Maybe. Did you observe it closely? Hmm, its feathers were mostly kind of silvery and red and blue. Its wings were about this wide. And don't forget her tail feathers. Yeah, they were really long. And red and white on the end. Those are great observations. I think I know what species of bird you are describing. It sounds like an Avasaurus. Avasaurus? Mm-hmm. Avasaurus live along the rivers and swamps of the western interior sea. That's where pteranodons live as well. Wow. You sure know a lot of stuff. <laughs> well, I am a bird watcher, and bird watchers love to observe. I also love to draw birds. You draw birds? Yes. Would you like to see some of my work? Yes, yes please. please. Excuse me. Ah, yes, here we are. This one is called Archaeopteryx. Ooh. This is one of my favorites. It's called Confucius Thornus. Talk about beautiful tail feathers. Wow, they're even longer than the Avisaurus. Oh, may I, Laura? Certainly. I'm so excited that you all saw an Avisaurus today. I have never had the chance to draw one, so I'll keep a sharp eye out as we ride the train. You never know. Dinosaur Once train. upon a time there was a mom. Her name was Mrs. Pteranodon. Sitting on her nest, she heard a scratching and said, Oh boy, my eggs are hatching. One by one, her kids popped.